Before you watch rest of the video, make sure you subscribe to the channel if you are related to DevOps and cloud in any way. If you are passionate about DevOps, cloud, AI, preparing for interviews or planning for your first job, looking for a promotion in your current job, you are on the right place. This is where we discuss basic to advanced AWS, Azure, cloud, uh, DevOps related concepts, which help in the day-to-day -day basis in your job. So make sure you subscribe before you watch rest of the video. Yes, Omkar, how can I help you? Uh, if you can unmute yourself. Yeah, am I audible? Yes. Okay. Uh, uh, I want uh, help from you uh, regarding my uh, 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 career path. Actually, mm -hmm. uh, I have an experience of uh, 2.7 in uh, software development. Mm -hmm. And in uh, uh, few months uh, uh, before, uh, after, before, in few months, uh, I thought that uh, I want to shift my career into the cloud or DevOps. And mm -hmm. uh, I I started preparing for it uh, uh, since the uh, last one month. And uh, mm -hmm. I am trying to get a job into it. So uh, while learning, uh, I started from the Git, GitHub, Linux, then Jenkins, and so on. While learning, uh, actually, uh, can I talk in Hindi also? <laughs> but why are you not comfortable with yeah, sure. it? Yeah. I know. <laughs> yeah, I'm comfortable, but I just ask you if I ask. Yeah, let's, 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 let's okay. continue English. Let's, if audience is mostly English. Okay. So, uh, uh, I'm preparing in the DevOps uh, and uh, starting applying for the DevOps also. Uh, so, I just need to uh, guidance from you that how would I apply for it and how would I uh, prepare for the interviews? Yeah, so this is this is very, like you need a generic response. What's What do you think is the right approach? Yes, actually, uh, I, my uh, doubt is like, uh, should I go as a fresher or I should... Uh, yeah. All the questions I have already answered on my YouTube already. Stop it. You okay. should always have your like your previous experience should not be wasted. If you if you go as a zero experience in DevOps and cloud, mm -hmm. although you have three years experience, then you are competing with so many other freshers and entry level people that basically you are getting into cloud. Mm -hmm. So I would suggest you build some solid fundamentals, group projects, instead of saying uh, entry-level uh, DevOps plan, you, you should say that for the last two years I have been working mm -hmm. as a developer, and, and the last one year I'm working as a DevOps of cloud engine. That mm -hmm. should be a good story to start with. Obviously, it will take effort, it will take time, but that would be a good story for you to when you are jumping into another time. And it will be a strong profile because even in top DevOps and cloud, if you show dev experience, then it's uh, it's considered as a positive thing. So, Actually, I have worked on the web development only in the previous. Uh, that's okay. That's okay. Uh, show it as a uh, uh, development experience. And last one year as DevOps and so on. Mm. That should be a good story. Something you can easily convince and explain just whatever application web development that you are doing, just containerize it and say that instead of hosting it on a web server, you know, we have uh, we containerized it, auto scaling, added auto scaling to it, all that DevOps cloud concepts and created by clients. So, it's very easy, and with three years' experience, is a very sweet spot because mm -hmm. that you are not a fresher or entry level, and also you are uh, you are not an architect. There where people sometimes are not hands, so you are you are a perfect uh, experience level. Okay. So yeah, build that. Uh, first, you convince yourself how you can justify three years of total experience to them, one DevOps cloud, and 
start from there. And uh, there's a small question that uh, uh, I tried the uh, DevOps uh, uh, projects myself, like uh, building the Jen uh, Jenkins pipeline or uh, uh, putting the Node.js uh, Node project on the EC2 instance. Like those projects I can uh, put on the uh, resume or end-to-end -end projects I need to... End-to-end -end strong experience, strong business value in that. So you can't say about yet. You should be saying that uh, some, some commercial application going on, which, which has some business value attached. Maybe a mobile banking application or something your customers. So that's okay. And check if you any way of it, we will suggest you look at the direction. I have... Uh, 10 to 12 projects listed on my top end that we do live with the students. Even if you don't register for the program, at least take a look at the, the tech stack, at the project description. So at least you can build to that complex Okay. 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 Yeah. All right. Good luck. Thank you, sir. Thanks.